So you might be wanting to go ahead and turn off Android Auto on really any Android phone out there. Now, doing this is actually fairly basic. So the very first thing you're going to want to do is you want to go ahead and open up your settings application on your Android phone. So you want to go ahead and open up your Android settings just like this. And then what you want to do is you want to go and tap on your search settings right up here. And you want to go, and you want to go ahead and click on Android Auto. So go ahead and tap on Android Auto just like this. And you will then come into this panel. So now what you want to do is you want to go ahead and basically just go ahead and click on your connection or previously connected to cars, which is right here. So tap on this and you'll come into this panel. Now what you can do now is you can go ahead and tap on the three dots right here and you can go ahead and basically click on forget all cars. Now what this is going to do is it's basically going to forget the cars around you when you're on Android Auto. Or what you can do is you can just go ahead and tap on the cars that are right here and you can basically, you know, individually remove the cars if you want to by clicking on the little car and then going through and clicking disconnect. That's an option that you have as well. And that can go ahead and basically fix some of these issues as well. Now, another thing that can probably cause some issues, or if you want to go ahead and basically turn it off for other cars, is when you go ahead and plug your car back into the specific thing, or if you're connecting your car via Bluetooth, there's going to be an option that comes up on your car that says, do you want to go ahead and enable Android Auto? you can either click yes or no. That's going to show up right here under accepted cars or rejected cars. So if it's a rejected car, it's going to show up here. You can go and you know, accept it from this panel as well. But basically you're going to be getting these pop-ups every time or once in a while when you plug in your phone to your car. So just go on and click accept or reject. And if in this case you want to click reject and then Android Auto will basically be turned off. So that's basically how it's done. If you have any other thoughts or questions, let me know in the comment section below. The like button, that would mean so much, but definitely hit that subscribe button. More importantly than everything else, I love every single one of you guys. Hopefully I'll catch you guys in the next video.